looks like I beat all my sisters here. I'm the first one at my mom's. We are going to do another little meeting here this morning. And so I have the house to myself. She's got the fireplace going. The wind is blowing. It feels so nice and relaxing to be here. A lot different than yesterday when all the kids were throwing food around. If you didn't see yesterday's vlog, go check it out. As Julie gets more and more pregnant, her hands get more and more numb. She's got this pregnancy-induced carpal tunnel and all the fun things that come along with pregnancy. I would take this over, I think, morning sickness. Yeah. The poor moms who have morning sickness for like months on and throw up over the toilet, oh, like yeah. that does not sound fun to me. No, you've been very lucky. So yes. if this is all you have, and I'll luckily we can hopefully try to prevent some of your symptoms or try to help your symptoms get a little bit better. So tonight we are going to try some kinesiology tape. So tonight we're going to tape it up, we're going to let her sleep with it on, and then we're going to see how she feels in the morning. Start with a little cleaning jelly. Make sure your skin's not oily. And some spray, some sticky spray. Don't get it on your nice clean couch. So, I'm really regretting this right now. Ooh, that's cold. If you follow me on Instagram, I did an Insta story, well, for you guys, it was like last week, um, of Landon deep conditioning the couch. He got the leather conditioning stuff and he conditioned our couch. And I was just thinking, baby Lucy's gonna spit up all over it. <laughs> Is it nice and sticky? Mm -hmm. Okay, so how do you know what you were doing right now? So my undergrad was in athletic training, so it was all sports medicine stuff. Um, so I learned taping and bracing and sprinting and casting, all sorts of fun stuff related to sports medicine. Okay, I can't hold the camera up any longer. <laughs> My right hand's falling asleep. All right, now for the belly. Well, now what are you doing? You sleeping on the job? <laughs> All right. You can tell that her whole like back and bum is over here because my belly's like shifted. Rub the baby. Stand up and see okay. how that feels. Oh, this is always like, I feel like, oh, I'm to get on the couch. Um, oh, I don't know, like I can feel the tape is there. It doesn't feel like heavy right down there because usually like when I stand up, like the baby I can feel is like mm -hmm. right down there and I'm like, oh, gotta go to the bathroom. But it doesn't like feel like that right now. So yeah, I guess you, I guess you could say it's working. We'll see. Yeah. I think the big test is going to be your arms tomorrow morning after you've slept with that on. Because yeah, you always yes. wake up with numb hands and see if that yeah. uh, makes any sort of difference. Cool. Well, thank you. I forgot the finishing touch. Boop. No therapeutic effect, but it will be so awesome to have right there. <laughs> see you guys in the morning. Oh my stars, Emma has turned into a unicorn mom. Let's sell her to Eve. Oh, Eve would love a unicorn. Oh, is that the sound a unicorn makes? I guess so. Oh dear. Oh my gosh. That is not a very smart unicorn. 
What's your synopsis on your arms this morning? Well, first throughout the night, I was like, oh, this feels good. Like, I'd make up frequently throughout the night. I was like, my hand doesn't feel so numb. And then I woke up at like 7 o'clock this morning for the day, and I was like, my hand is killing me. Aww. So it was off and on. We'll see how it is like during the day as I'm like holding Mommy, things. So, okay. I don't know. What to say about it, honestly? Yeah, leave it on Maybe. for a while. And, a bit. Yeah, leave it on for a while. We'll see if it helps. If not, we'll try something different. Are you my baby? But you look so big. Your feet are over the edge. I don't think you would be able to fit in here. Baby? Are you my baby? Not for long. Oh, close your eyes, baby. Close your eyes, good night. All right, well while you're in there pretending to take a nap, I have been in the baby's room and what I am doing right now is, let me show you. I am just going through some of the clothes that I've been given or that I've gotten and I need to go through and take off all the price tags and wash them. So I've got a laundry basket right there. This might sound like a dumb question but I asked Ellie the, the other day if she washes all her clothes and blankets and new bedding and stuff before the baby comes and I think, uh, the, I knew the answer was yes. I know most people wash things before they use them, especially with babies. But I'm embarrassed to say that I don't think I ever did that with the other kids. I would just get an item, keep the tag on it, and wait until it fits the baby, and then use it, and then wash it. But I never wash anything beforehand. So I'm going to do that this time, though. I'm going to go through and just take all the tags off and wash everything so everything is nice and fresh and ready to use. But I'm just starting to organize. I'm going to go get tags today to go on the drawers to label the drawers so I kind of like know what's in the drawers. And I'll put them on Emma's as well. I've got all the baby bath stuff in here, or at least some of it, ready to go. I need to grab a few more items. If you saw the video with Ruby the other day, Eve picked those unicorn shoes out. I've talked about these baby bow moccasins before, and that same company, Caroline Jade, now has tie-up ones, little lace-up moccasins, which are so flippin' cute. So I'm gonna leave the description, or the link down in the description below, so if you wanna go get a pair. I believe the first 250 people get a free pair of moccasins, so they're super cute. Go check them out. But I'm just trying to organize it to like all the newborn summer items, and then like later into the summer, like the zero to three month items. And then all like the six, like like starting in the fall, those items. So a cute, a viewer sent that cute little pajama outfit. Look how cute the bum is. Ah, look how cute that bum is. I love it. After I go through all the baby clothes and wash them and stuff, I've got to figure out what else to do this weekend. Landon has left me and the kids. He and Joel and Dad and I think Kevin and little Chad, they all went back down to Moab to go on a little guy's four-wheeling trip. So I hope they have a lot of fun, but stay safe, boys. Are we going to play Legos all weekend? Yeah, we're going to have fun playing Legos. Mm. Do you know how many times I've built this dang Lego car? And how many times have you busted it? All right, well, you gotta go get your hat because it is hat and jammy day at preschool. Ew, no, it is not picking your nose day. <laughs> it is hat and jammy day at preschool. So <gasps> that is disgusting. There's toilet paper. Do you wanna scrub toilet paper? Please tell me I'm not the only mom who has kids that do that. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only mom. <laughs> <laughs> a little update about my tummy. So usually when I am laying down or sitting down and I go to stand up, I can just like feel the weight of the baby. Like she's head down, it's just a ton of weight right down there. And it actually has helped, I think, keep my t tummy just kind of like pulled up. This is doing nothing, <laughs> that's just decoration. But uh, it really does help my stomach feel not so heavy when I stand up and start walking. But for my arms, um, yeah, I didn't really feel much of a difference because when I drive or use my phone or hold stuff up, 
like this, like holding stuff, I can still feel my hands go numb and tingly. So, sorry Landon, that did not help. Maybe, I mean, I know a lot of people use braces when they sleep at night, but I'll just kind of suffer through. A few more weeks left. <sighs> Can you guess what movie we rented for tonight? <laughs> Cooper, you know what we rented. What movie are we watching? The Great Showman. Yeah. Movie night. Why is it that everyone's asleep but you? Is it because you took a nap today? Did dad wrap his arm up? Yeah. That's silly. I have an idea. You know what we should do? We should try out these new blankies. Should we swaddle him up like a baby? Yeah. Good idea. Can you scoot back just a little bit? Oh, sorry. Oh, you're okay. Hey, little baby. Right there. Oh, little baby, mommy. Little babies. Yeah. We'll do one arm. Watch this. You do one arm and you tuck it under its back. You move the feet up. Yeah. And then you put one arm down. Oh, you and you have a swaddled baby bunkie. Aw, I too Okay, can you go to sleep now? Take him to bed. Oh, no, leave him swaddled. No. Aw. Okay, take your monkey and go to bed. Okay. Thank you, I love you.